Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves somewhere out in Missouri with JC News Now as he shows how much of a royal pain in the ass he can be to anybody that he comes in contact with. And well, he just about gets the wrong one today. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Pink shirt still on the phone. Man. <laughs> Somebody coming out to talk to me. Looks like. Let's see what's up. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Doing well, man. I just have some patients that are a little scared. They just don't know why they're being recorded. Okay. Is there a reason why you're recording this story? Sure. Okay, so it's a HIPAA violation because it's technically medical. So with the medical thing, it's like being outside of a hospital and reporting. You can't do that. The onus is on you to protect that. Well, uh, Jimmy Boy, the onus is on you to get yourself a new set of frauditor scripts because these old ones are getting tired, lazy, and everything like that. Just like you. But you're right, Jimmy Boy. It is on him to protect the medical information and everything, all the patients and everything like that. Which is why you're not going in there because you know better now. Which is why you became such a coward in this particular scenario by not stepping in there and taking the trespass or arrest or whatever that could have been. Because you are on the run and you don't want the police to know where you're at. Well, keep this up and the police will certainly find you. Sir? The onus is on you to protect that information. I don't have to obey HIPAA. I don't work for the medical profession. Well, sir. You do. No, I, I understand that. What's your name? Travis. Travis. Yeah, Travis Hart. Okay. Yeah, you can get that. All so right. I'm now going to call the police because it is actually illegal what you're doing. That's fine. Okay. It's not. I'm on a public sidewalk. But you're not, you're recording a private business. So? You, you're not allowed to. Who says? Um, HIPAA. HIPAA? It's, I, a, it's a medical thing. There's people here getting their, their prescription. Okay. I can see where your thinking's flawed, but go ahead and do what you got to do. So you can record people out of Walgreens as well, like if they're at the pharmacy. If I'm not, if, if I'm standing on a public sidewalk, I can record anything I see. You can't trespass the eyes, bub. Again, another bit of flawed reasoning, uh, Jimmy boy. You can trespass the eyes as soon as the entire body is trespassed off a of premises. They're trespassed too, you dumbass. So your little blanket statement fallacy doesn't really hold water now, does it? A little longer than a few minutes later. <laughs> well, now I kind of want to stick around and see if the cops come. You can find it yourself. All right, cool. Don't worry about it, Karen. Oh, I'm not Karen. All right. <laughs> You're number one, too. <laughs> Let's see here. Mercedes. Don't put your camera on me. You're going to be a star, buddy. All right, again. Look me up. All right, I will. <laughs> he called me a mo he has no idea does he <laughs> excuse me sir you're making my customers uneasy uncomfortable there goes the popo right there It doesn't seem like they was too interested. Mm 
Hey, if you want to apologize, I'll tell you where to find it. Come on now, man up. Oh, come on now, Jimmy boy. We all know that you don't have any fight game to you. You're just a little guy. A little guy with a big mouth that got you in trouble with this guy right here. And, well, he definitely clocked you that one day. And, well, the, uh... Prosecutors refused to do the case because, well, you had it coming because you filmed everything. And that's your problem. You film all your crimes, you film all your antagonizations, so nobody wants to deal with you. And that's a big reason why you're going to go back to prison here soon once they find you. Because you were stupid enough to film everything you did. So congratulations, Jimmy boy. You are a freaking moron. I want to offer you. I appreciate it. I'm good. I appreciate it's a hot day. it. Oh, that's okay. I'm good. Thank you, though. I appreciate your kindness. You're very, very welcome. What was your name, sir? Uh, you can call me JC. JC, would you like yeah. my card, sir? If you wanted to reach out, we could have a conversation. No, that's all right. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. All right. Have a great day. All right, you too. Well, they kind of made up for it a little bit. They come out here and offered me a treat, and that was nice of him. But I'm all good. I think you misinterpreted that situation right there because he did say he wanted to give you a call which probably means he wanted to talk to you about this whole HIPAA thing and how you are less educated than him and everything like that but you know what you'll never listen you never do and you get arrested for it quite often speaking of which why don't you just uh, come out of hiding turn yourself in and expedite the process You'll be out in a couple of years anyway. And I'm sure Bubba and the boys are just dying to see you again. Oh, come on with it, big boy. Come on with it, big boy. I'm standing right here. There's nothing but air right here. Nothing but air. You're number one too, buddy. You're number one. Bam. Bye, Karen. Fuck you. Fuck you, Karen. You're number one. Bitch. See ya. <laughs> you should follow that woman's advice and get yourself a real job. But uh, it doesn't really matter anyway, considering that once they uh, track you down, oh, you're going to have a job, all right, washing Bubba's clothes in the toilet in exchange for him. Well protecting you from the other prisoners because of your mouth situation. Yeah, because your mouth gets you into trouble quite a bit. And I know they wouldn't take that kind of uh, lip in prison from other inmates. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?